tough night at the ballpark for Southern Ohio as they fall to the Licking County Settlers by a final score of 5-2. to two. And Kevin, it just didn't seem like anything was really going for the team early in this ball game. The pitching wasn't great. You know, Jake Harper wasn't bad, but not at his best. The hitting wasn't uh, by any means where it has been in the last couple of ball games. Just a tough outing. Yeah, hitting was really a weak spot for this team. Uh, they didn't really seem to convert when they had some opportunities. Uh, they, they stranded five men on base, so, so something you certainly don't like to have. Uh, but as you said, just an overall not a very good effort from the Copperheads here tonight. Yeah, they lose for the second day in a row. And after the game, we, we caught up with some of the players. They were frustrated, you know, about what had gone down. And it was just a tough day at the park. Yeah, Jake Harper I talked to. And, uh, you know, it just didn't really work out for him. It wasn't his night. Uh, he gave up a few ground balls that just didn't really get out of the infield. Uh, but sometimes those go for hits. And that's what we saw here tonight. It's pretty aggravating. I mean, when they get the hits like that, like the blue, like the ones that fly over your head that you know you're not gonna be able to do much with or I mean I made a couple mistakes like on the home run I was probably right down the middle but I mean it's aggravating knowing that you're making good pitches and they're just getting lucky with the hits but still gotta find a way to get out so with the defeat Southern Ohio falls to 16 and 10 on the year they're still amongst the league leaders though there's still a lot of room for success to stay in that playoff race. Tomorrow they'll be back in action against the Hamilton Joes at Bob Wren Stadium. Uh, not a very good Hamilton Joes team. Good chance to rebound. Yeah, this is a great opportunity for the Copperheads. They are currently 3-0 against the Joes so far this season. Uh, so you'd like to like their odds coming into the game here tomorrow night. So with that being said, please make sure you check into all the social media that we have. I always say it, Facebook page, Twitter at Go Copperheads, and the YouTube page, search Copperheads Baseball. We constantly update with not only that with not only recaps, but other stuff surrounding the Copperheads. But with that being said, he's been Kevin Noonan, I've been Ryan Boyd, and this has been a Copperheads recap of a tough night at the ballpark as they lose 5-2 to, to the Licking County Settlers.